Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Mindy and this channel will be, will be about budgeting and crafting and the name of it is Mindy's Crafts and Cash. I'm retired, living basically on social, social, oh I can't talk today, social security and living my best life. I do diamond painting, card making, scrapbooking, coloring, glue booking, and collaging. Today I'm going to continue working in my glue book that is my alphabet glue book so each page is a different letter and i'm just looking for images that go on that letter i have pulled several some stickers some die cuts some uh, from cut and collage books and i worked on this yesterday and i had so much fun i'm going to continue it today so first of all i have this cardboard sticker and it's a cup so i'm going to add it right to the c page i'm going to put it right up here so i'm starting to overlap a little bit okay next i have this heart sticker i like this one a lot and we'll go right over to the h page and we will add the heart add it right over here now here I have this is a real stamp I don't even know where it's from but we'll put it on the S page and we could stick that right in there and I'm gonna pull it right off and paste it right down okay that's filling in nicely Next, I have this um, cut out from a cut and collage book, and this is a little girl. So we'll find the G page. And here we go. We'll put her right down there. And for this, I'm gonna be using my glue stick. Get her right on. Today is another pretty nasty day in Florida. I'm really feeling sorry for the visitors. It really hasn't been pleasant at all. Okay, next is A for Aloha. This is from a magazine. So we will put this right on the A page. And I actually have three A pages because I wanted to have the pages start facing each other. So I'm going to put this right on the first one. I'm gonna put it right in the middle here, aloha. And uh, I have the word flower. So we'll put that on the F page. And we'll put it right under Florida. This is like the easiest project ever, but it is so relaxing and it's so much fun to see the pages start to fill up. Okay, here we have a house, back to the H. We'll put that right here. And this came from a magazine or maybe a catalog. I do use catalogs and magazines and let's smooth that out a little bit. And I use die cuts and I use my cut and collage books. Okay, back to G, here's a glass. And I think we'll fussy cut this. So that'll just take a minute and I'm using my Tim Holtz smaller scissors and they have serrated blades so it really seems to grip the paper nicely especially when I'm doing these thin papers that come in the magazines and some of the magazines lately the papers are really thin okay here we go 
So how has your weekend been? I'm filming this on Christmas Day. Just having a relaxing morning. And we will put this right in here. This is called a bone folder. It's well loved, well used. Okay, next I have a pineapple sticker and I'm going to find the P and we'll put it under the letter P right over here. Okay, let's see what we have next. We have some bears in the water. When I was in Alaska, uh, we were out whale watching and we happened to spot a bear on the shore. So we were able to watch the bear go all around the shore. It was really interesting and we were able to get pictures. So that was, he was just checking everything out and exploring and we were nice and safe on the boat. We did see some whales, but not that many. That's a very exciting trip and I uh, highly recommend it. I thought I would like it. I wasn't sure I would love it, but I did love it. So I'm used to cruising in the Caribbean when you're spending the time sitting on the deck and enjoying the sun. Okay, for P, I also have a bunch of penguins. So I'm going to add the penguins to the P page. I find penguins are fascinating. And when I would go to SeaWorld in Orlando, Oops, too much glue there. The uh, exhibit that I enjoyed the most was the penguin exhibit. That's so cute. Okay, let's get rid of some of that glue. Okay, let's see what else we have in the pile here. Ooh, here's a nice anchor. So I think we'll put that on the A page. that right in the cover. That was a, it's a sticker, so let's see if we can unstick it. If not, we'll just glue it. Okay. Here we go. Well, that's a little awkward. Stick it right up here. Get rid of that. And this is Garfunkel from Simon and Garfunkel. Art Garfunkel. So I think I'm going to put him on the G's since that was how he was known with Garfunkel. And that was the first album I ever bought was a Simon and Garfunkel album. I still play their music all the time, and I find it extremely relaxing. I was able to play some of their songs on my guitar when I was in college, and I still love their music. So sorry that they split up. In fact, you know the song Kodachrome, that's a Paul Simon's song, Whenever I have to unload the dishwasher, I race against the song to see, it's a pretty long song, if I can get the whole dishwasher erased before the song is over. And usually I'm pretty good. It really puts me into high gear, which is fun. 
So I find that's a little bit of a trick when I have a chore that I don't exactly love. I try to put the music on and have a race. So that is what I do. Okay, now I have a dog. I think I'm gonna put him on. This is from a cut and collage book. And these pictures really crack me up. So I'm going to glue him on here. You can get all the way around to the edges. And here we go. I bought this book thinking I would use these guys for ATC cards, which are artist trading cards, but they're two and a half by three and a half, and he's a little big for it. So I put some on my printer and I tried to shrink them down, but the quality was not terrific. So I did not really use them for much. Okay. Here we have a hippie. So we'll put her on the H page. All you need is love. Da 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 da. I promise I will not sing on this page. But we'll put her right over here. The H page is moving right along here. Okay. Another one done. And here we have a roller coaster. So we'll go to the R page. PQR. And we'll have a little excitement here. Another thing I do not do in retirement, I don't run. And I don't do roller coasters. I can't see trying to spend money thinking I'm going to die. Being a senior citizen, that will come soon enough. I don't have to pay for it. So I get more of a thrill from a winning slot machine. <laughs> yeah. Now here we have a light bulb or an idea. I guess we will, let's see, I don't think I have much on the I page, so we'll put it on here for an idea. Ooh, little bird. Okay, another sticker. And it also says innovation on it, so that's perfect for the I page. And we'll get this page started. We'll put it right in the middle. We could work all around it. And... Ah, uh, peace. Let's find the P page. And here we go. I'm going to put it on the other page and get that page started. Wouldn't it be nice if we had peace? And we have a whale, so we'll put this on the W page. I'm really glad I'm using up some of these stickers. I've had them for a long time. I haven't really found much purpose for them. So I am happy that I am using some of them. Use your stuff, use your stash. So really, I haven't bought anything for this book. I had the book. It had been my mortgage book from when I had a mortgage, which I no longer have. And I had all of these papers and I had purchased all of these little tabs. And so I, I had a hole punch. I just was able to put the book together, which is on another video. Okay, this will put under J for jar. I could put it under M for mason jar, but we'll do J for jar. And we'll put it right next to my jumping, my jumping rope lady. Here 
There we go. If it goes over the top a little bit, I'll just trim it off later. And we have this pretty bird. This I had cut out with a die cut. So it's another way to get your images to put in the book. Whoa, that was not what I wanted to do. And we'll put the bird. Oh, so we'll have the birds and the bees right over here. Okay, now we have either a tortoise or a turtle. And I think we'll give a little fussy cut on him. And we'll put him on the T page. So what do you do the week of the holidays? Do you do anything special? I'm having I have a couple of Mahjong games scheduled this week. And usually on Mondays, I do volunteer work. Today is Monday. But um, because of the holiday, they're closed. I work in the We Care office at my community. And what we do is we loan out equipment to seniors such as companion wheelchairs, regular wheelchairs, canes, crutches, and um, walkers. And it really came in very handy. I borrowed a walker when I had my knee replacement. I didn't have to bother buying one, and then I just returned it once I wasn't using it anymore. Um, people come down for the season, and rather than bringing equipment down with them, they borrow it. And a lot of times people just call us that they're picking somebody up from the hospital and they just need a wheelchair to help get them in the car and then get them back into the house. So we do provide a service that is well used. And you know how it is when you volunteer, it makes you feel good that you did something helpful. So we will just add more right here and I will trim it down a little bit. And stick it right on the bottom there. Do you do any volunteer work? As a senior, I can give my time. And it's a little harder to give a lot of money because I do basically live on Social Security. I do what I can, but at least I can do my time, share my time. And I am going to cut out this truck. I use these on cards. I made some Christmas cards using these, but uh, I didn't use this one. So now I will use it. I'm gonna just fussy cut around it and put it on my T page and get that page going a little. These specialty glue books are really a lot of fun as well as this one, I have an en masse glue book, and that's also called a scavenger glue book, and each page is a different topic. On this one, each page is a different letter. So that, that one is fun also. You just find topics that interest you, and you collect images to go on each page. So some of my images are chairs and boats and beach and lighthouses and faces and eyes. So that's a lot of fun also. Okay, so we'll put that, find the T page. This I just stamped and then I colored it in. Could have stamped it on colored paper, but I didn't. So we will put the truck right here. And that's nice and colorful. Get that going on this page. Here we go. Use the bone folder, give it a smush, smush, smush. 
In the meantime, while I'm doing this, I hope you will like, 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 as Lisa on Figuring Out Retirement does, and subscribe. It's free. Just help, help a gal out, help a retiree out. Okay, just a couple more. Here we have S, we have some sneakers. S, T, go back one, right over here. I, I like the colors, but I'm gonna put it on this one. Okay, here we go. I know we say, I say here we go a lot because I'm trying to fill in the time. It's very hard to be crafting and talking at the same time and trying to think what to say. Here's another sticker, it's an H, so we'll go back to the H page. With all the tabs, it really makes it easy to go back and forth. So we'll pull that one off and stick it right here. Make sure I'm not covering him. And moving right along. And here we have kayaks. So let's go find K, which we don't have yet. So yay, we got this page started. Let's get it all glued down well. On the video I taped yesterday, I didn't realize I had shown this. I was using it to glue on, and I had the whole address showing. So I had to delete the video, and then I had to learn how to do that because I'm new to this, and I didn't know how to do that. That took a while. And then I was able to go back into the initial video and blur out the address, which I didn't know how to do right away. So it was definitely a learning curve when you're doing all of this. And here we have a book. So let's put this on the B page. And this is the kind of thing that I probably will put other things on top of. But in the meantime, actually I could do it this way. Maybe I'll do it this way on the left page. Here we go. And start this page off with a book. And I'll probably put other embellishments on top of it. And I'm just going to do one more. And that's it for today. And I'm going to add a hot air balloon. And we'll put it on the left page. It'll match so pretty. Prettily. Prettily, is that a word? And now I've used a lot of stickers from my very weird sticker collection. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a very happy holiday and a happy and a healthy new year. And keep crafting. Have a great day.